there you are. Here you see my little tawny frog mouse. It's not an owl. It's a tawny frog mouse. And a um, friend of mine gave me that bird quite a while ago. And um, he found it in his backyard. And uh, the dogs were chasing it. And he was a bit worried about the bird. And he couldn't keep it. So he rang me and I said, yeah, bring it over. I will look after it. And... Um, so that's what I did. I bought it a, a little cage for it so I could carry it around. And um, first thing I did, I brought it to a vet to see if uh, the bird had any, any injuries or anything, but no, it didn't. Here you see me feeding a little mouse to the bird. Yeah, it ate two of these mice a day. And... Um, yeah, so no, the bird had no injuries, it was fine, and um, the doctor said I should release it soon, and I said, yeah, 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 I will do that, just, just a few days, and then see what happens. Out of these few days, uh, that grew into a month and a half, I was looking after the bird, and oh, we had such a good time. Yeah, so... Um, in the first few days, the word bird was a little bit shy, but then when it sort of realized that I was a food source, I was a favorite person. And we had quite a cuddly time. Oh, it was so cute. So what happened, so I came in in the office in the morning, sat down at my office, and the bird came out of the cage. The cage was always open, so I never locked the bird up. And the bird came out of the cage, flew onto the back of my office chair, jumped on my shoulder, and um, more or less spent the rest of the day <laughs> on my shoulder, literally cuddling in. Later on, there is a little picture um, where you see the bird cuddling into me. Oh, we had a marvelous time. Yeah, and then uh, a few friends of mine came and had a look at it, and it was all very sweet and very cute. It was cuddling with everybody. It had no problems. It was very happy around people. Yeah, so uh, then came the time to release the bird, and uh, I will make a few comments uh, when that little clip comes up. Till, so now just enjoy little bear trees. That's what I called her. And then came the day where we had to release little bear trees. And um, I was sure that the bird would just fly away, but no way. In the office, it always avoided the open door, didn't want to know about it, never been outside, wouldn't, didn't care. And here, same thing, I was sitting on my finger, had no intention going anywhere, so I shoot it away. And what did it do? It landed back on the car, then went to the other side of the car. It was not going to fly anywhere. So with the umbrella, I finally sort of shoot her away, and she flew in that tree over there. And um, that is her natural habitat. These birds are sitting in the trees, waiting for the food to come to them, picking up uh, insects and all sort of things that walk past them and um, yeah so that was a rainy day where little bear trees gained her going to have freedom and um, I think it was a very plum little bird I fed it very well 